For the latest Jurassic World 2 news updates, visit HybridNetworkYT.com. What's up, watchers? We'll hear with the Jurassic World video for you. So, earlier this week, news recently broke that another super hybrid seems to have been confirmed for Jurassic World 2, Fallen Kingdom. Now, the name of this new dino has apparently been copyrighted for some time by Amblin Entertainment, the studio that Steven Spielberg owns, and may have been predicted in Jurassic World from a comment that Vic Hoskins made where he states, Imagine, that one, a fraction of the size, Deadly, intelligent, able to hide from the most advanced military technology. A living weapon unlike anything we've ever seen. So the name of this is the Indoraptor. And the Indoraptor seems to be what was teased in one of the first posters for the film. And looking at the image that was released, it seems to have similar teeth to the Indominus Rex. What we can assume is that they changed the base genome from a T-Rex to a Velociraptor maybe even swapping out the DNA codes themselves to make them smaller, but just as lethal, like Hoskins was suggesting. The picture shows director J.A. Bayona on what seems to be a possible maquette of the new monster, peering in at it with its jaws open. The little skin we can see looks gray like the Indominus's, but a darker shade, so that could be from the raptor genes implied to be in it. The question is, since the film seems to be returning to Isla Nublar, where did the Indoraptor come from? Was it a government created as the facility the director is in resembles some sort of caged area like something the government may have made? Was it an egg that was asexually reproduced by the Indominus before it went on its rampage? And if so, that would mean that the Indominus evolved into a new species through birth. Right now, all we can do is speculate and wait and see. So. Tell me what you think of this teaser of the new Indoraptor in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe to Hybrid Network. I'm Will, and I'll see you next time.